Hi everyone, it's Natalie here. To those of you who have seen my math videos, you may know that I generally do one video per contest, talking about things like the logistics of the contest, my personal experiences with it, and how to do well. However, COVID has transformed daily life, even affecting math competitions. While I was looking over the competition calendar for the 2020 to 2021 school year, I have realized a lot has changed. I'll be posting both the pre-COVID and the post-COVID math calendars on my website, which is mathandaiforgirls.org. I am making this video to briefly explain what's happening to various math competitions in general. For more specific information, you can Google each competition. First of all, there are five main categories of post-COVID math competitions, which are basically the same, moved online, hybrid, online, and in-person, postponed slash canceled, and too early to tell just yet. Let's go through them one by one. Basically the same, category one. These competitions are the ones that are done through your school. For example, the AMC 8, AMC 10, AMC 12. MAA, the organizers of the AMC competition, are assuming that schools are at least partially opened so people can take part in competition in person like before. However, competitions that remain unchanged are in the minority. Category two, which is the competitions are online. This is the majority of math competitions. The HMMT, Harvard MIT Math Tournament, is now online, and the Math Prize for Girls competition is also online as a social event instead of a competition. Category three, there are a few math competitions that are partially online and partially in person. This is happening to the Math Counts competition series. The chapter and state rounds will all happen online, but Nationals is going to be in person in Washington, D.C. in May. Category 4, Postponed slash Cancelled. This category includes PUMAC, which is the Princeton University math competition, which has been postponed till next February, but with no details about whether it'll be online or in person just yet. The Math Majors of America tournament at Yale was also supposed to be in April, but it has been postponed to October slash November with no details just yet. And finally, the last category, too early to tell. There are competitions that happen later in the school year, which were largely canceled or moved online in 2020. Some of these competitions include Armel and the Math Kangaroo. Obviously, the organizers still have time to see what COVID looks like in the next few months before making a decision. So all in all, there are a lot of changes and the situation is quite fluid. If there is a competition that you are interested in, I advise you to keep checking their website for more information and contact the organizers with any questions you may have. Thanks for watching and good luck with your mathematical endeavors.